Okay, ladies and gentlemen, I'm going to make this real quick. The conversation I had with a debt collector that I put the video up shortly on the Eon YouTube channel. You will see that those idiots decided that they wanted to do something stupid. They wanted to argue with me. They wanted to challenge me. We're getting ready to do a lawsuit against them, and this is where, this is this is how we're coming. I want you to, it's called Fountain Pen Money. I want y'all to listen for a second. Y'all don't mind? I don't mind, but I need y'all to listen. Hold on. Commercial banking and loans, when a bank issues a loan, it essentially creates new money. For instance, if you take out a mortgage for $200,000, the bank does not transfer existing money from its reserves but rather creates a new deposit in your account. This process is facilitated by the bank officer's approval and signature. Proof, the Bank of England explains this process in its quarterly bulletin, stating that, whenever a bank makes a loan, it simultaneously creates a matching deposit in the borrower's bank account, thereby creating new money. This is what Professor Richard Varner was talking about. Go take a look, Richard Varner, YouTube. Listen to him. He knows what he's talking about. Again, it's called fountain pen money. Your signature is what creates the money. That's where they're getting that from. You don't hear them saying that because they don't know what they're talking about. They're just regurgitating what somebody else has said. It's called fountain pen money. Don't believe me. It's not my term. I didn't create it. The court said it's a sovereign citizen thing. Well, go and look out of the Bank of England has documented it, has stated it. Go and look at how money, modern money mechanics mentions it. Fountain pen money. Look it up. We'll be talking about it in the future. Hey, I got to go. A lot of work to do. Hey, Midland Bank, Midland First Bank, we're bringing a lawsuit. We'll be letting you know how to join those of you who have accounts with those idiots. Got to go.